This fully free AI-powered ID is insane and beats Cursor. It gives you access to Claude 3.7 Sonnet, GPT-40, Claude 3.5 Sonnet, and even the new DeepSeek V 3.1 and the R1 model for completely free, which is insane. So I thought, today I will show you guys how you can use this amazing code editor and also talk about it a bit and also maybe test it out a bit. So you can download Trey, form their official website. I would try to leave a link in the descriptions below. Once you're there, you can download it for your operating system. Currently, only Windows and Mac OS version is available, but Linux would be available soon. Now, after you have downloaded it, you should be able to see the installer in your downloads. Open it and proceed with the installation. Once you have it open, you can choose to import your settings from VS Code or Cursor. Well, I will skip this process. You can choose your preferred theme and all. I already have it installed, so I did not get that interface. Now you can open a project and you are all set. And you can use Claude 3.7 Sonnet GPT-40 and even DeepSeek from here for absolutely free and unlimited. Though, you might get in a queue if you use Claude 3.7 Sonnet as the server is facing heavy load of Claude 3.7 Sonnet. So I prefer you use Claude 3.7 Sonnet 5 Sonnet or DeepSeek V 3.1. Trey has two modes, chat and builder mode. The builder mode will create and edit files like a full stack codine agent and the chat mode is just general chat. Now, let's test it out. I will tell it to build a YouTube clone in HTML, CSS, and JavaScript. Let's see what we get. This might take a minute, so let's wait. So, it has finished the YouTube clone, and as you can see, it did a great job. From now on, I will use this instead of cursor. I mean, it's free and gives unlimited access to Claude, DeepSeek V 3.1, and GPT-4 Omni. It's too good. So, that's it for today, guys. Hope to see you on a future video. And don't forget to like and subscribe. And as always, happy coding.